Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome to what is, in effect, a winter wonderland. The uh, snow-decorated perimeter of the pitch is perfect evidence of this and, indeed, evidence of the efforts that the ground staff have made to get all of the white stuff off the playing surface. The forecasters do say that we will have snow throughout the game, but we have been told absolutely categorically that things aren't expected to get any worse. The atmosphere is terrific, the turnout, considering the weather, is excellent, and you do get the sense that a special event is ahead of us. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. It appears to be a 4-4-2 formation, Jim. Reminders of a, a golden era in English football, I should add. And it continues to hold its place in the modern game. Playing a second striker runs the risk of being outnumbered in midfield, of course. So, with the wider pairing and fullbacks, plenty of running has to be part of their play. And, of course, the right service into the box. So, off we go, then. Hoists it forward. Played into space out wide. And that has been cleared. Citadella have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. It's a loose ball. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Has he picked him out? Gets away from his opponent. And they've been... Gets up to hit it! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra-sharp. That's a fine challenge. Played in with accuracy. It's got through. Crowd calling for him to shoot. Up he gets! It's in! And right on half time, that is telling. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Deadlock. And the half time whistle goes. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. 
Well, I'm certainly pleased the fans and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? Leading 1-0 at the break. And the action has already resumed here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Sticks in a foot to win it back. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Bit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. It's the through, has a pop! Really well taken goal! A two goal lead, and they're firmly in control. That is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. So that's two now without reply. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. It's a throw in. to get it forward quickly Back to the keeper and go again gets into a dangerous position cuts it out well played he saw that coming forward it goes It'll be a throw-in. Citadella are making a change now. Well, with the introduction of such a tall lad now, we may well see uh, a more predictable, lofty route forward, but it's still very hard to deal with that, you know, if they, if they can affect it right. And it's played forward. Has he found his man? Ahead by two, and just about into the home straight. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Time added on will be two minutes. be the final act so they bask in their win and a genuinely professional performance and the results which is well deserved so Tim, how do you reflect on what we've seen there's a solidity about them almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold that is the